Hey kids, have you ever heard of a little thing called pride? Pride is all about loving the things you or others do. But it's good to know that pride can be a good thing or a bad thing. So here's what you need to know. There are two types of pride. The first type of pride is the good kind. Like having pride in how hard your team played in your basketball game. Or pride in the score you earned during a spelling test. This kind of pride motivates you to work hard. But there is another kind of pride that is not good for us. Pride goes before instruction. A haughty spirit before a fall. If you don't know what haughty means, it just means you think you're better than everyone else. It means you're stuck up and you look down on others. And there are consequences for acting that way. Let's learn about them from a guy in the Bible named Saul. Saul started out humble. Saul was just a normal guy living his life when suddenly everything changed. He was picked to be king. Do you know why he was chosen? Well, he was the tallest, most handsome guy in all of Israel. And because God picked him. So he didn't actually do anything to become king. But at first, he knew that pretty well. He understood that he was just a nobody. And God was generous to give him the opportunity. But over time, it all started to go to his head. Saul ended up thinking that he was better than others. You know what that's called? Pride. You know the kind that makes you think that you're the most important in the world? <gasps> well, that's a pride that took over Saul's life. It caused him to ignore God, and he actually made pretty bad choices. And that made him almost great. If you want to be almost great, be like Saul. Saul could have been a great person in game, but his pride ruined him. He could have used his position to make God proud, but instead, he just cared about himself. Memory verse. Get along with each other. Don't be stuck up. Make friends with nobodies. Don't be the great somebody. So kids, be careful about the kind of pride in your life. Don't be like Saul and think you're better than others. Be humble and nice and remember that God gives us everything we have.